Hello, hello, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to another daily challenge video. It is the 5th of June, 2023. 1,100 people have tackled the daily challenge before us. Let's see where we rank amongst these first greats. You might hear in the background the sound of my guinea pigs drinking from a water bottle and squeaking. They were perfectly quiet <laughs> until I started talking. Um, anyways, <clears throat> only one person has completed it. Uh, but you know what? Out of the first thousand, I one one person with the perfect score. That's about normal. Anyways, let's go ahead and go. Let's go ahead and go. It's, I'm actually doing this relatively early. It's 11 p.m. on the 4th, but the daily challenge for the 5th came out. Weird, I know, right? Anyways. <laughs> um... <clears throat> I don't even need to move, baby. I don't even need to move. Do I just guess? Do I just guess? I might I might just guess. Um this this is a hundred percent without a doubt Singapore. Like one hundred percent without a doubt Singapore. I'm just gonna guess. Okay. Alright, okay. <laughs> It just, it, it, it was Singapore, man. <laughs> uh, once you've been placed in Singapore enough times, I've actually, I actually think we were placed in this neighborhood before. I feel like we were placed in this neighborhood before. Interesting. Yeah, or maybe, maybe it was this one. Might have been this one. I don't remember. Anyways, Singapore, the first few months of this year and the, the, the last few months of, of last year, just nothing but Singapore. Nothing but Singapore. <sighs> Museum of Ice Cream. I, that's what I thought I read. <laughs> okay. Next round. Um, oh, God. All right. Well, we went from Singapore to... Some a country that has Cyrillic and it's very snowy and the roads are terrible. Uh, I mean, <laughs> Russia <laughs> or at least a, a former Soviet state. Um, we'll look around a little bit before I just place us in Russia. Yeah, yeah, I think I think we will. I think we'll look around a little bit. There's a doggo. Hi, little doggo. That looks like. A wild doggo. Kind of, kind of, hmm, interesting. Um, the only thing that's getting me, these roofs. These roofs are weird. Those roofs are weird. Those roofs feel more Mediterranean to me, but I could be wrong. I'm now trying to think, okay, what's the typical Russian roof look like? And for the life of me, I cannot remember I don't know, man. Like, are we in Russia? We're just in like a, a, a nobody town. I say nobody. I mean, there's there's quite literally a, a, a bunch of houses, but it, it's just a middle of, of almost nowhere location. There's a sign way over there. We're aiming for this sign. Okay. Okay. The sign is not helpful. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, we're going back to the start. We're going back to the start. We're going to go, I guess, we'll go this way. <laughs> oh, no, wait, there's there's a big town over here. There's somebody walking as well. They're going for a walk? They're going for a jog? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I don't know, man. I want to say, I can't, I can't tell if this is Russia. It feels very Russia, but at the same time, it's like, is, is, are we potentially in like Ukraine or somewhere? I don't think this is Ukraine. Serbia? Hmm. We might be in Serbia. Oh my God. Hello? Tell me, are we in Serbia? You, you literally have nothing on you. 
Oh god, I can't. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put us in Serbia. Uh, I should have came this way first. Oh my god, we were in Bulgaria. We were just out out in the middle of nowhere in Bulgaria. Interesting. Okay. Mm. Well, <laughs> I was right. It wasn't Russia. The houses, the houses were giving me a different vibe. The houses were giving me a different vibe from Russia. I, I can't remember what the stereotypical Russian roof looks like, but I, 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 the, those roofs did not look like the stereotypical Russian roofs. Like the clay tiles? I don't know. I could be wrong. I could be very wrong. Anyways, next round. Anyways, next round. Anyways, next round. D L C. Is that like flipped? Why is that? We're, we're probably not going to be able to see this, are we? No. Okay. Oh, hello. Conte Theobraid Oren, County of Tipperary. Oh, this is, um,. Uh, this is, uh, this is, um, Ireland. Pretty positive this is Ireland. Right? I could be wrong, but I'm, I'm, I'm almost, I'm almost pretty positive this is Ireland. Oh, hello. We have, this is Ireland, right? Hold on, let me go back. Can, oh. Oh, yeah, look, yeah, yeah, look, Ireland. Ireland, ancient something. Mm. Okay. County Tipperary. Tweem. Oh, oh, yeah, we can go this way. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Not that it's helping me any. Dune, Kappa Moore. And we have Tweem. Dune, Kappa Moore, Tweem. Tipperary, maybe Tipperary is like an actual county. Hold on. You know what? Instead of looking for cities that I don't know, how about we how about we move around? How how about we move around? Yeah. How how does how does that sound? I always get locked up looking for a city that I'm never gonna find. I mean, sometimes I do find it, but I would say a good eighty percent of the time I just don't find it, and I I I don't I don't look around enough. We're not going this way. This is like that's a no. <laughs> we're gonna go back this way. Dune community. Okay, so we're in the city of Dune. It's a, is it a small city? I don't know the uh, the geography of Ireland. Like, where the mountains are, where the lowlands are, where the hills are, stuff like that. Um, what are you guys looking at, huh? They're just chilling here. Hmm. Okay. We, we're, we're out of time, man. <laughs> we're out of time. Holy heck, what a nice house. And there's a bird here. Oh my god, County Tipperary's right here. Oh. <laughs> okay, so it's somewhere in here. Do we see a dune? No way. Oh, we were on the border of Tipperary and Limerick. Oh. <gasps> Oh my god. I opened it up and I just see County Tipperary. Where did I see it? Oh, it was right here. Oh. oh. Okay, cool. <laughs> next round. Oh, next round. Next round. Kroner? That's, um... Is that... Uh, KR, that's, that's Swedish Kroner, right? Is that Swedish? Possibly. <laughs> There's no flags on the flagpole. KR, KR is the Swedish Kroner, right? 
I'm pretty sure. Let me go back and look at this. That I, I am I am reading that right. Like that's Yeah. KR is 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 Kroner. I'm pretty sure I'm reading that right. Okay. All right. So this is this is Sweden then, yeah? Alf school. Oh yeah. Come on. Like this is this has got to be Sweden, right? <laughs> yeah, .se. Does, is that a, yeah, dot, 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 we got Thai food? Look at this, we got Thai food in Sweden? Comvic? Okay. Dot SE, I'm, I'm trying to think, is like, is dot SE, because dot, uh, S, S, is S, S, W, uh, Z, uh, uh, Zwali land? I don't, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's waving. He's got his cool little hat and he's waving. Oh, <laughs> all right. We got it. We got to give this guy the thumbnail, right? We got to give this guy. Look, he's uh, he, he doesn't know. He looks up because he sees the car pass. He waves and he's still waving. <laughs> When's he stop waving? Oh, he stops waving when the car gets over here. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Okay, um, are we good? Do we know? I think we know. I think we know. I think we know. God. <laughs> uh, <laughs> look at that language. Uh, <laughs> what? They all have the, the, the KR... It's, it's, it's KR, Swedish Crow. Oh, are those like parking permits, maybe? Hmm, maybe. Huh, uh, this is a big city. This, this is the only city that I can think of that's like this size is like Stockholm, right? Right, it's gotta be. My guinea pigs are really loud. Sophia. Oh, there we go. Cool. 4989. Next round. Last round? Last round. Oh my god. Really, man? Why you gotta do this to me? Oh, uh, why you gotta do this to me? <laughs> uh oh. Okay. Uh this is kilometers, so that means we're probably in Canada. I'm going to assume British Columbia for now. Um, this looks like it might be a bit further north as well. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put us pretty high up in British Columbia. I, 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 I based on what I see in this town, I might move us down to Vancouver. Um, I'm hoping we see something in this town that uh realigns my 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 guess. But I'm going to assume this is British Columbia. If we could see, oh, Yukon. Oh, okay, never mind. We're up in the Yukon. I'm just going to put us in Whitehorse. Because all the other towns in Yukon are very small. <laughs> all the other towns in Yukon are very, very small. Um, Yukon, okay. We actually might be able to see if this is White Horse. Well, I mean, I don't think this is White Horse, but we're probably closer to White Horse than anything else. Right? I'm, I'm going to assume so. Oh, no, we are just straight up in White Horse. Bobcat of White Horse. All right. Let's go to White Horse. Uh, we were heading to the south, so we're, we're heading... We're coming in from the north. Do we see Bobcat of White Horse anywhere? What else? What else was here? Actually, I don't know. Um, okay. You know what? Yeah. So this is a pretty straight north-south road. It bends a little bit. Uh, like here. No, I did not see any of that. Okay. Um, I guess we were on. Maybe we were on the Quartz Road. I didn't see like a McDonald's or a Walmart or anything. Let me go back here. Let me go back to the start. We only have 42 seconds. 
we're heading in from the north. C and D feeds. Oh, maybe we're like really high up here. That's Crest View. Are we on Mountain View Drive? Yep, C and D feeds. Okay. So where are we on Mountain View Drive? Um, About halfway. I can't quite tell. Oh, sweet. Okay, we were only 78 yards. 5,000 point score up in Yukon, Canada. <laughs> uh... 24,121. Not too bad. Where do we lose points on? Oh, we guess Serbia. I just, I didn't know. I, it did not feel Russian. But at the same time, I didn't know. The clay tiles made me think of, like, Greece. But I didn't want to go that far south, because I don't know what, like, like, the <laughs> weather's like seasonal-wise when it comes to, like, snow and stuff. <laughs> uh, okay cool uh we did pretty good Twenty four thousand one hundred twenty one out of the first 1100 people uh wow this was a lot easier than people did really good oh my god okay wow people did surprisingly well holy heck Holy heck. 158. 158. 158 on a score of a 24,121 out of 1,100 people or something. How do I get how do I get back? What is that? World Cup 23rd. What is World Cup 23rd? 13th to 14th of October, Stockholm, Sweden. Join us as we invite you to the first ever World Cup hosted by us. A competition where the contenders are breaking new ground within the world of esports as a participant in GeoGuess or esports. <laughs> okay. One world champion. And they show off an avatar. Lame. $50,000 prize pool. That's pretty cool. Confirmed players. Blinky, Jacklins, Kodiak... Massium, Mato, Potato, Zigzag. More players to be announced. How do you how do you become? How do you can I attend? How do you decide who which players to invite? Selections made based on the past performance and reputation in the GeoGuessr community. There will be age requirement. There might be multiple players in the same country playing the World Cup. Oh, it's country. Oh, I see. Huh. So it's based off. Past performance? Inter interesting. Okay. Uh, anyways. Um, I wanted to see how many people... 1,200 people. Okay. Okay. Well. Thank you for watching, everybody. Catch you on the next one. Have a good one. Take care. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye.